and Stars in Time occasionally explores topics that some players might find upsetting, such as death, mental illness, and violence. Please watch with care. Hello, I'm just going to leave that one in. That's fine. Hello, everybody, and welcome back to my fellow procrastinators to another episode of In Stars in Time. I am Edge from Decidedly Distracted, here as always, joined by... G1. Luna. Yeah, I'm leaving that in at the intro. I don't care. Uh, welcome back. Yeah. Last time we got to the last floor and things are not great right now. Um, Isabeau now has paper mache for hands um, and we are firmly out of anything to heal us. So we're going to check Let's through door on the right or doors on the right to... however they are doors locked shaped like an angry mask oh mm -hmm. oh what uh, what, it's what? All... Uh. torment oh it's three for the price of one why make up the time uh. Um, you need healing, Sifrin. Um, everyone defense up now. Odile, I would very much like an examine. What a mess. I can't tell which is which. I can't tell when they'll attack either. Well, how much health it got left. So annoying. All right, everyone, let's untangle this one. With extreme prejudice, madame. How else? You can't see its health or when it'll attack, but you can see them. You just need to aim. All right, slow. Uh, wait. Hold on. I think you can follow the the lines of the arms back to their heads. Like I think the bottom one is paper. Oh wait, no. You can just. Okay, you're slowed. So let's buy one, get one, three. You wink and attack. God, this one's not a fun fight. How is this not a boss fight? Does this honestly, like, give it a moment? But I mean, like, this sort of gimmick is what you'd expect from a boss. Not in a game like this. Alright, now we're gonna focus paper on the rock. Hitting both. Hey, there we go. Smash! Smash. There we go. Hey. Oh god, that was uh. a pain. Yep. Alright. What? That Hello? is a mirror. A mirror? You and your allies are reflected in it. That's a big mirror. Massive, even. And there's not really anything else of interest in this room. I don't know anything about it. Before the house shifted around because of the king, it was in a part of the house I didn't often walk by. Hmm. Isabel seems to be looking for something. If it is what I think it is, then... It should be... Ah! Oh, oh. Everyone, oh my God. say fromage! What was that? Oh, look. <laughs> Something's on the ground. Oh my god. A piece of paper? <laughs> Behold! 
Oh. It's a picture of all of you. It's us. Ziffrin <laughs> <laughs> looks like there oh. should be drool coming out of the corner of his mouth. Odile looks mildly like, looks confused. Mirabelle is like hunched over, like interested. Bonnie is just all up in this thing's grill. And is, then. And Isabu has turned into a hamster. <laughs> hamster. Hamster. This is lovely. <laughs> Isn't it? It's a crafted mirror that takes pictures. I heard rumors someone was creating one, but I didn't know that someone lived in Dormont's house. We look so surprised. <laughs> Only because Isabir knew this was coming. Pictures are so rare. It's nice to have one of us. Thank you for telling us about it and for taking a picture, Isabu. Oh! <laughs> it's nothing. Got a memory of reflection. You'll always remember this. Ooh, what is it when here? memory of reflection is equipped, your defense will automatically boost it at the start of a battle. What should we do with it? Hmm. Odile looks at you. Would you keep it safe? Oh, one with all the secret pockets. You beam. <laughs> you got the mirror picture. Put the picture in your pocket along with your souvenirs. Yay! Oh! Flash of the mirror somehow made something appear. Reach down and pick it up. Found the smiling key. Keychain dangling from it is shaped like a smiling mask. Put the smiling mask in your pocket. Oh. You now know where the smiling key is located. Oh, that's neat. It's time. You get the keys based on emotions. No, living oh. time. Okay. Ah. Okay, it's just one of these. Oh. This is fine. Ish. Oh, so I thought. Okay. Um, I would like you at full health just because. Smash. Just kill it quick. Oh, great. And frozen. And just. You. Unfreeze. Just attack. Hey, level 49. And let Crashfield break. Break! This is but it's a new skill. <laughs> I have gotten stronger. You got the memory of break! Break! You'll always remember this. When equipped, your fighter will be able to use Break Break as a skill, even if he isn't at level 49. Break Break is a skill that lowers one enemy's defense. Ooh. Oh, uh, she's back with 2 HP. Yep. It's not... Not ideal, but we will work with it because we have no choice. Time for a battle of attrition. Uh... Oh. Time to examine everything and hope to God. Closet contains advantages, painkillers, and. Oh, eye patches. Those look, these look ugly. Friends is better. <laughs> Does your eye patch fit still, Sif? I can adjust it if you ever need me to. You smile. Isabel made your eye patch when you lost your eye. He apparently crafted it so it wouldn't bother you or itch or anything. It's comfy and fits you so well. The broken figurine of the change god. Some old boring books. Oh? There's a Kabuan book here. Ah. Oh. That's a craftonomy book. We don't really have time to read about craft of any kind. Let's keep going. You leave the book alone. See Maribel in one of them. 
Very supplies. God damn it. Barrel. Full of various nuts. Cooking book all about... Croissants? So, Mirabelle, about Vogardian croissants. You tune out. Don't want to even think about croissants. Odile is smiling, which means they're probably done. Hmm. Fascinating. Thank you, Mirabelle. <laughs> you were right, Vera. You have something to say, perhaps? Oh, no, we would never. <laughs> it's just... It's very cute, right? Yes. It's cute. Your eyes light up and everything when you're learning things. It's cute. Cute? Deal isn't cute. She's all. No, Bonifas. They have a point. I am very cute, aren't I? wonder how cute you'll think I am when I put wasabi in your sandwiches when you least expect it. You'd help me out, wouldn't you, Boniface? I'm always up for putting spicy stuff into people's lunches, so yeah. Oh no. Uh, sorry, madame. We, we didn't say anything. You chuckle. Ah, uh, looks like Sifrin wants a sandwich as well. Would you like me to offer you one of my sandwiches, Sifrin? You've been spotted! <laughs> that would be, that so, would be so cute, cute of you, you Odile! <laughs> I'll put twice as many peppers in there as deal. See that you do. Scary. You know, depending on the type of sandwich, no. that might actually be pretty good. Yeah, memory of first strike. You'll always remember this. One equipped memory of first strike makes everyone faster at the start of a battle. Oh, that's massive. That's useful. Equip that. No, who was that? Who? Who is a uh, deal? Maybe. <gasps> yes. Yep. Sorry, Odile. I don't mind your minus five to stats, but right now you're in a position where you kind of need it. A dog. Dog. Doggy! Happy! And an actual human, also standing right there. They have a massive bow, too. Looks cute. Almost as cute as Odile. <laughs> massive bow. Massive bow. That's her mom. Eh. Oh. Oh, that's my friend. Eh, close enough. <laughs> I gave them that bow. And that's their dog! Oh. <laughs> I was trying to say, it's like, oh, the that's my fucking friend! Priorities. Oh, and that's their dog! <laughs> you can never tell them you've noticed their dog before them. No, never, ever, ever. They'd make fun of me for days. At least they'd think it's funny, it seems. If he did that from, to me, Mirabelle, my revenge would be swift and absolute. I would never, Madame Odile. Never, ever. This was a one-time mistake. I'm glad they're with the dog, at least. They're not alone. Dog and its owner. Mm -hmm. So there was nothing in here. Wait, no. go back. We, we, got, we did get that memory. Present. There is a bottle on the table in the bottom corner. Some vials. Pepper juice. Ooh. Not what we needed, but it's something. Everyone's attack up. I think we need to be better lookout for bottles. Yeah. Specifically. Did we see a smiling door at all? I think it might have been one on the left. I am leaving. Yeah. That one feels faster, but I am leaving. Alternatively, I'm Making not taking chances. Heal with Mira. Yep. Knew it. Yeah, we can use that to cheese some healing. We can also just 
quick yeah, run over here. Yeah, but this one is fun. <laughs> no, it's not. Hey. Save your progress? Yes. Is there anything else to explore, or do we just have to loop? Um, I think There's... we have. We can see those keys. Because we have the smiling key now. Don't know if it'll do right. anything, but... Maybe. Key time! Ah! Oh. There is what looked like may have been an achievement, but I can't see what it's it, what it is. Pain. Oh, this is not ideal. This is like none of it wants us to do anything. Someone frozen in time. Oh. If you read that, you cut out. <laughs> Her. Whoa. That Whoa. is not my line. Don't worry, I've, I've done it too. She's another housemaiden. I always wanted to talk to her. She's so cool. Her crafted pieces are always so perfect. Nice for the sadness to just kind of, you know, just sit here and let us talk. Everyone. Like this. Also, I love how it's the only people we're finding is the pe is o the only people we're finding are people that Mirabel actually gives a shit about. Except I mean, that one guy who stole something from except, her. Well, he she sort of did because she, he had her book. It, it, I get the distinct impression Mirabel basically knows almost everyone, and anyone who would still yeah. be in here is like. She it's just a little amusing that she all she has an encyclopedia of knowledge on uh, the people uh, that we have find frozen in time. Well, she kind of needs to be encyclopedic when she's traveling with Sifrin. All right, I assume the line's been said, so I can move on. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. I want to be just like her when I grow up. Huh? But you're an adult, pal. You're already grown. <laughs> hmm. I. Oh no. <laughs> she's realizing she's a real actual grown adult. We all go through this realization, Mira. It sucks, but we'll, it'll be okay. <laughs> oh. No, sorry. It's not that. It's just. She looks so scared. I... Let's go, everyone. Please. Sure, yeah. Thanks for... Yeah, no, props to the Sadness for just kind of sitting there and letting this conversation happen. I, I, I think we hit its zoning. Oh. That's... That's... That's my room. Oh. Pillager room files closet a lot of different dresses look similar to Mirabelle's. Is it her closet? Horror books. There's the cursing of Chateau Castle issue 68 death die dice maker 100 ways to die horribly the meat slicing ah that last one's actually a cooking book a Lot of horror books in there. Is this one about a group of young adults being forced to kill each other for someone's entertainment? It is I no longer feel safe with Mirabelle Hmm. We should have a book club Red. sometime. Just the two of us. We should. The red flags, they grow. We could exchange letters and recommendations after we beat the king. What? Just you two? The rest of us aren't invited? No. Girls only. Yeah, back off, Isabu. Being told to back off by Mirabel herself. I feel blessed somehow. <laughs> oh my god. What are you, Isabu? Rolled papers. A false of nature. Barrel. Full of various nuts. Full of nothing. Barrel. Full of nothing. One of these barrels will have something. Full of what? I, I mean... Closet filled with unsafe looking know? potions. Hmm. Was your roommate making bombs? Because with all the material she has in here, it looks like she was learning how to make craft bombs. What? No. Was she? 
<laughs> I'm just saying. She has the materials to make a craft ball. Looks like she didn't finish it, though. That makes you feel better. How do you know how to make a craft bomb? Oh, I learned it while I was studying to become a defender. But but that isn't but isn't that just called the knowledge? I've never learned that. I've never learned how to make a bomb. <laughs> I know I'm a kid, and you think I definitely know how to make bombs, but I've never learned either. Oh oh. What else does it need then? Um. Why? Zah. <laughs> we have to throw a bomb at the kid. <laughs> It'd be so funny. What? <laughs> yes. It would be funny. It would. What else do we need? Your roommate has some stuff already, so we just need... Very can Isabel starts explaining what you need with very confusing words. What? Your simpler words, sir. Oh. There's already a short gizmo gadget here, so we just need a long thingy thing and a secret ingredient. Oh, okay. Makes sense. It doesn't... Time to find those things! You got the short gizmo gadget! You put the short gizmo gadget in your pocket along with your souvenirs. Get those bottles. Some vials. One of them is broken, but the others seem intact. Let's see. Pepper juice. Thyme. Ginger. Fuck! Damn it! Paper still with complicated equations. A bed. That's my roommate's bed. You think she's okay? What does she like, this roommate? Please? She's the worst. I really don't like her. Oh? I know Pal can hate people. She doesn't clean her side of the room ever. And uh, she leaves her experiments and weird potions around everywhere. And she always sings way too loud. And when I ask her to maybe change songs and sing something I might like, she always tells me, No can do, princess. She's mean and has no respect towards others. Well, excuse me, princess. All right. <laughs> so, a normal roommate. Maybe. But... Even so, not seeing her around, it really worries me. Positive. Gotta stay positive. Oh, Mira. Uh-huh. Yeah. Okay, um, I would like to... Let's go make a pipe bomb. <laughs> if we can figure out how. A bed. Oh, I'm sure we can. Is that your bed? Uh, yes. Um, what gave it away? <laughs> it smells fruity. Just like your name. Mirabelle Plums. <laughs> My roommate gifted me some Mirabelle Plums since it's so a while ago. She may never clean her room, and she may keep me from sleeping by muttering formulas to herself in the middle of the night, but she does give great gifts. Some flowers. I'm trying to grow them out. They haven't died yet, even though I haven't been here for months now. I suppose that's something I can thank the king for. Hey, new record! 
Yeah. <laughs> Mirabelle's dresser. It'd be rude to look inside so you don't. Mirabelle is thinking about her roommate. Yeah, this way must lead to a shared bathroom. All right, fine. Oh, but all we're finding here. Yep. So let's head to the, other to the right. All right, I went that way the first time. What's up here? Oh. Oh. Paper and pen. Looks like someone's in the middle of writing down their change. You and Odile look closer. Ah. Hey, don't look. It's private. Just because everything's frozen doesn't mean we should look at everything, you know. Oh. I wasn't aware. My apologies. He's right. You look away. Oh, it's fine. It's fine. You two did not. But still. This brings back memory. Ah. Uh, I would love to craft my body more. I'd love to be two centimeters taller. Why two centimeters? Aren't you tall enough already? I think you're too tall and you should cut it out. Cut what out? Anyway, Mira, you don't understand. With two more centimeters, <laughs> I'll pass the threshold. What threshold? <laughs> With two more centimeters, I'll finally be tall with a capital T. <laughs> <laughs> I support I support you and your tall dreams My guy, just get pumps <laughs> What a simple reason Crafting your body, huh? And you know, instead of crafting your body itself Maybe there are easier ways To gain height Oh? Like what? You could wear high heels High heels hurt my feetsies Drink lots of milk Milk makes me sick sometimes. Ah, intolerant pain. I feel F F's in chat. Will you tie your hands to a pillar and tug on your feet really hard? <laughs> well to try. I mean spinal decompression. <laughs> I don't want to have rope. I'm sorry I brought up to this I'm sorry I brought <laughs> us to this point. Let's stay focused, please. <laughs> Some vials, let's see. Salty broths. <laughs> Frozen flowers. They smell like flowers. An empty, clean bed. Something on it. It's an animal, but not real. But it's made out of fabric and other things. It's usually for kids. Those things have a name. It's, uh... It's a stuffed animal, dummy! Oh! Guys! Friend forgot an easy word again! Sif, Rin! Sif. We really have to do something about this, Sif, Rin. Did you really forget a basic word like stuffed animal? Hey, some of the things you don't remember the words for aren't basic. I use my brain for other things. Things other than remembering the word stuffed animal. What do you, do you use the space in your brain for anyway? Puns. Oh! As a matter of fact, yes. Well, that's fine, but... My brain is just stuffed with puns. Crap! <laughs> yes. You have brought this ruin upon yourself. <laughs> the mild, let's see. Pepper juice, thyme, ginger. All of the things we don't Candles. need. Pomegranate. 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 Uh, ma nut Pa, ma, gra, no. Yeah. You did it. Everyone claps proudly. <laughs> Candles. Lavender. Hey. Closet filled with many different types of clothes. Oh, look at this shirt. It has the same material as your cloak. Great Sif. This also looks incredibly warm. Still don't know how you managed to wear your cloak this whole summer. You've had this cloak for a while. I never really get hot with it, though. 
Really? This man probably is wearing nothing under that cloak. It is just cloak. <laughs> Sif, could I look at your cloak for a sec? You nod. Taking care to not touch you, Isabeau kneels and takes a hold of your cloak. Oh! Your cloak's been suiting for some kind of temperature regulation spell crafted into the stitching. That's kind of cool. I wonder you always look comfortable no matter the weather. God, I want one of those. Fuck! That is such a... I would huh? put that into all of my work clothes. Dang. What? Isn't that... Really, really advanced crafting? Aw. It's also been crafted to make the cloak grow with you. It must have been incredibly expensive. Also was handmade. How long have you had this? You try to remember. Nothing comes to mind. You shrug. Uh... I mean, like, it was mildly established that we didn't really have much memory shit in general, but, like, are, are, do we just flat out have amnesia or some shit? Well, it, I... Part of it is maybe amnesia. The other fact is he's probably just purged all of his knowledge for puns. I would not be surprised with Sifrin. Yeah. I am really jealous. Sorry. <laughs> puns and debauchery. Yeah, if you ever sold this, you'd be set for a few months, if not a whole year, you know. Yeah, That's it. So, sorry to say, but if, like, I sold something, it would be set for a few months through the whole year. No! If it was something like that, that's with me for life, motherfucker. That goes in the will. That, yeah! <laughs> yeah! The craftsmanship alone. Crafting stuff into the stitching is really interesting, actually. Looking like a true clothing designer, huh? <laughs> oh well, is that a new one? I that is a new one. Bashful is. Did I tell you about that? Hmm. Oops. Oh Got yeah, on this thing we didn't talk to him about his dream. Just, just because your clothes are so cool. <laughs> oh, thanks. That is absolutely new because we we didn't talk to him about that yep. on this. Looks oh, oh that's crowd. awkward. Interesting. Can you tell me more about this? Oh well. Hey, hey, deal. They already know all this stuff. Hmm. What do you mean? Um, you're always asking questions about Vogar change and stuff. But don't you already know about it? Huh? You've never thought about it. Yeah, I was wondering about this too. You're always asking questions, which is fun. But I couldn't believe you'd go to another country and not learn all about it beforehand. If only because it'd make you look stupid. How Don't insightful you two. Oh no. What? Do you already know about the things you ask about? Hmm. I do know some of the things I ask you about, but I also believe there's a difference between knowledge learned in books and knowledge learned by talking to people. Knowledge is important, but the meaning behind it, the emotional piece, that's important too. Books don't tell me anything about how it feels to be surrounded by Vogardian culture, to be bathed in it, but the three of you do, and you clearly love your country, love the change belief, and it's making me like it too, I suppose. Why is Odile oh. such a fucking mood? <laughs> yeah. Uh... Oh, Madame Odile. I don't get it. Huh. It's okay. You don't need to understand. I just want to know all that I can about Vogardian culture, that's all. Alright, what's in the... Let's check what's in the book. What's in the box? How to craft your body. Wow. This book looks simpler than the one I've studied. Apparently, they've made some big strides in bodycraft recently. Before, it took close to a year to make big changes. But now you can make a change in a month or so. It's interesting. Crafting your body is so... accepted here in Vogard. And Kabu, using craft in yourself would be grounds for prison. What? <laughs> prison? But why? Because if you can craft your body to your liking, where's the limit? 
Take the king, for example. They say he crafted his body to become so massive, he can destroy houses in a single gesture. And that's without mentioning his mastery over time craft, too. What? That's... I'm not saying Kabu is correct. I'm just telling you their point of view. Plus, it's not like there aren't ways to do body crafting Kabu if you know where to look. Oh my, man. Were you part of the underground resistance? I'll never tell. Resistanceology! <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> there it is. It's been a while. Uh, hello. Someone frozen in time. Oh, that's... I... Don't know who that is, actually. So I'm about to take my foot and put it in my mouth, apparently. We had another of these earlier, I think. So you're already, you had preemptively done it. Past you did it for future you. Don't worry. I, I guess. <laughs> they have a cool necklace, though. Let me see. Oh. <clears throat> I know them. That's another house maiden. I hadn't seen them in a while. I thought they were dead. I didn't know they were changing. Come to think of it, I hadn't seen them for a little bit before the king. Maybe they were close to Dung. Close to. Okay. You I think they were close to Dung crafting their body. Close to being done, I guess, is what it should have been written, but eh, whatever. Yeah, it was hurting my head. Technically, their their grammar is correct. Close to done crafting their body. I if mean, we can beat the king, yeah. you can see them and meet them again. Yes. I like the insinuation. You can see them and meet them again. Well, the changes. Yeah. A closet. You open it. Found the angry key. You now know where the angry key is located. Get like an angry mask. That's a different face than the key you've gone before. Why are the faces different? Does it mean something? What's this about? Oh, every Cajun will have, will probably have a different mask. Huh. So every mask will have a different emotion. Is this what it's trying to represent? Oh, I know this one. That's the change god. No matter what emotion it is, if it has a mask, that's the change god. The change god always has a mask and never has the same expression. Or art style, for that matter. It's to show the change god is ever changing. But also to show us that emotions are fleeting. No matter how wonderful or awful you're feeling, this feeling will fade in time. Why do you get emotions that have to fade too? Why can't we keep being happy forever? Because it's boring. Like, no offense, but like, to an extent, like, that's just... After a amount yeah. of time, that's just mind-numbing. At least that's how I yeah. kind of, like, would imagine it. That'd be boring. Can you imagine? It'd be, like, hmm. Like, being forced to eat your favorite food forever. Oh, God. I'd like that, though. Are you sure? Really imagine it. Eating your only your favorite food all the time. Can I stop eating it when I'm full? Nope. Can't do anything except eat. I can't go to the bathroom? <clears throat> nope. Oh my god. That would suck. <laughs> Indeed. Just like feeling terrible forever would suck too. And some of those feelings might stay for a while, make their home here. But knowing they'll eventually go away, isn't that a isn't it a relief? Hmm. All right. Well, we, we have go. one more room to the right to check out. Oh, yep. That. Too. We're not really looping. Oh. This gate is, is locked. Cold. Locked by one of those weird word locks. Something written above the lock, too. Maybe you should take a closer look. 
You cannot read what is written above the lock. Just trying to read this makes my head hurt. It's like the island... The island that That's disappeared the island. and then no one could remember what the name was? Uh, not the island, the country. Oh, the yeah. It, it was an island, wasn't it? No, uh, it was a whole country. North of north of uh, Vogar. Maybe you should take a closer look. Look at it curiously. You look at it. It's about to see as you look. Have you never seen a lock like this before, Sif? It's a special kind of Vogardian. Oh, right, because we didn't look at the other one before. Yep. Instead of a key, it needs specific words to open. Words? Yes, you just need to say the words aloud. I think they call it a... a an open phrase? An open phrase. Fascinating. So what is the phrase for this lock? I... do not know. Ah, uh, so it's locked. E yes. Yahoo! Or is a sentence written above the lock too? But you can't read it. Such an imposing door though. I don't remember ever seeing it before. Hmm. There's some text written above the door though. Book. It says Yeah. Yowch. No, no, it's just... My head hurts. Leave the door alone. Not like we're gonna be able to do anything check with the, it right now. Check the... Hold on, go back up. Check that crack. Hole in the wall. Hole doesn't really bring you anywhere. Ah, never mind. Alright, well, let's go check out the side. Everyone is faster. Uh, we're already fast. We don't need to. Yeah, I was gonna say we don't need to do. I'm the rotation guard. has been broken. Why? I don't it's know. Uh, we need rock. We do. Thanks. Oh my, wow. All right, well, finish it, Isabeau. Smash. Oh. Bam. Crit hey. on a defense down. Paper a V. Paper Alpha 5. Yeah, I was about to say that was Alpha. Huh, I finally figured it out. You got the memory of oh. Paper Alpha 5. You'll always remember this. When equipped, your researcher will be able to use Paper Alpha 5 as a skill, even if she isn't at level 49. Paper Alpha 5 is a skill that deals big paper damage to one enemy. God, it's like they're prepping us to deal paper. Yeah. Which is mildly concerning. Can't go anywhere there. That's all... That's... Why don't we go down and see if we can't look for the gizmo for the bomb? Ooh, actually, that's a fair point. Jukes! The Jukes! Tools to make pottery. Open book. Da, 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 da. I don't think there's anything in here we can really use. Jukes? I. Nope. Opposite I of Jukes. Right in here. Um. Um. What the um, scissors. Oh, scissors. what the Only fuck? Scissors. What the fuck are you? That, that is night nephew. Oh, no. oh, it has a body. It just has very, it's just big hands. It is very buff apparently. Everyone speed up. Ah, uh, defense down to you. I would like to examine you. <laughs> Look at its face. Cute little face. Where is the face? <laughs> Cute but strong, aren't you, little guy? 
defeating a sadness like this will definitely make us stronger. Let's say on our guard. We can still run away if it's too strong for us. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The fact that it's given us a warning about escaping concerns me. Yep, just slightly, you know. Oh god, that still charges fast. All right. Scissors. Um, just attack. Who attack with scissors? It's paper type. Oh, I see now. There's its face. Bunny. Hey, let's go. Defense up. Uh, your turn. Mirabelle. Because I kind of no want you to heal a deal. Oh. Scissors. Once more. And we'll get the jackpot. Let's go! Ow. Oh, that did hardly anything. I'm going to lower your attack. Screw you. <laughs> Uh, normal yeah, attack. Normal attack. And I get to do this again. To be fair, though, the amount of damage it did was while we had a defense buff. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Hey, a thousand experience a thousand. received. A All right. Thousand. Well, let's head out. And I'm going to go stop by the save point. Because we are at time. Shit, really? Yeah. Already? Yup. God. This, this one went by a little bit faster than the last. Yeah, so much Damn. for going back a loop to get items. Hey, we got items. They we... weren't the items we needed by a long shot, but we got them. We got what we wanted, just not what we needed. Yeah. No, opposite. So what? So what's the what's the thought process then? Do we go check out what we can do with this other key? We might as well. And then because we can there. we can yeah. loop at the tiers at any time. Uh, Although hey, we might die. as well figure it out. Honestly, and see if we, we have could anything also, we... we could also just do that, and then after that, go do the thing at the front that we've kind of been putting off to explore el elsewhere. And then if we die yeah. there, then we just loop, right? The the only thing the only thing I'm thinking about though is just a matter of it, if we have something we need to go back into like town or something else for on this floor. Yeah, fair. Well, like everything we can do before we loop. Pretty much. May as well. Well, in that case, um, all right then. So, thank you all so much for watching another episode of In Stars and Time. We'll see you all next time when we do what, do that, do the things we just said. <laughs> we'll see you all in the next episode. Jana.